Hey everyone, my name is Angela Hockman. Thanks so much for tuning in to STL TV where you get to experience St. Louis. Okay, I am very excited because my guest today is Morgan Casey. Morgan is unstoppable in a word. She started an amazing organization called Date Ideas and Things to Do, right? Who doesn't need that? Okay, welcome, Morgan. Thank you, I'm glad to be here. I am thrilled to sit down and talk with you. Um, because one of my favorite things is just being a tourist in my own city. How have you made a business out of exploring all the amazing things to do in a city? You know, it's, it's easy when you live in an amazing city like St. Louis. Sure. Um, sure, you can easily say, oh, there's nothing to do today. But honestly, if you look, there's so, I mean, to the point where just today, I have like five different events I'm supposed to be at. I don't oh know my how gosh. I'm going to do it. Well, but, <laughs> but thanks you, for making this one of yeah. them. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, it's, you know, that's like every day in St. Louis. There's so many yeah. different things um, in different neighborhoods. It's just, it's awesome. And I think truly it takes an effort to get out of your comfort zone, get out of your own neighborhood, go explore other places. So describe to me what in a nutshell is date ideas and things to do. Yes, yeah, so it started as a Facebook group two years ago. Um, my fiance and I, we were asked actually um, by a coworker of mine if we could create something where they could follow all the cool places that we were going personally in the city. <laughs> so I was like taking her on these really cool dates, posting them on my personal Facebook page sure. and they were going viral. So um, when she asked me to do that, I came home, I told Donna, I said, hey, we need a name. Um, what are we gonna make this group? And so of course, Anything that we do, like it, when it's events, we try to keep the title extremely simple, yeah. straight to the point. So mm -hmm. I do like adult proms, adult Easter egg hunts. You know exactly what it is just from the title. Right. So date ideas and things to do, that's what it is, it's right? Perfect. And so, it's, it's for everybody. Everyone. That's yes. the thing. And I love when people say like, gosh, there is a lot to do in St. Louis because you are unveiling all of these different wonderful events. How do you... How do you come up with all of your content? Where do you find it? Are you just researching different things and events and neighborhoods? When we first started off, it was really us like researching the things and finding them, but now everything is finding us. Um, so bet. we get lots of messages and emails um, of people letting us know what they have going on. But the cool thing is, is the fact that we run our platforms as groups it's not just Donna and I that are promoting and saying where people should go. It's really the community. So people go on there and they ask, hey, you know, my son is turning 16. Where's a great place to take him? Or my anniversary is next week. Looking for a great seafood restaurant. Where should I go? And <laughs> they ask these questions and there's like hundreds of comments of people yeah. giving suggestions. It's awesome. Okay, so with all of these suggestions coming at you, how do you sort of sift through and essentially validate everything that's a, a legit event? Yes, yeah, so you know, a lot of the things they send them to us and we'll check their websites and the ticket process and things like that. Um, but the platform is so powerful that we've been able to sell events out in a matter of minutes. I am not surprised one bit. And you are the real deal. I've seen you at one of the coolest events in town recently. It's the City Flavor, where all the yes. food was unveiled down at the new soccer stadium. And to see you there in your brand, I'm like, okay, so she's <laughs> she's running with like the real deal. Yes, it's been awesome. Yeah. Um, the soccer team has actually allowed me to um, help with the LGBT you know, workshops and everything no throughout the way. summer. So I've secretly oh been around the soccer team for a while now. Oh gosh that is amazing now that's like a whole other episode we can sit and talk about the energy around that stadium oh, incredible so Morgan you have not only sort of handled this whole date ideas not only in St. Louis but talk about the other cities that we can find you yes so you know shortly after starting the St. Louis group we thought maybe we'd get like a couple hundred people to follow it. Yeah, we yeah. had over 5,000 members in the first week. Oh my God. So <laughs> our St. Louis platform has grown to almost 300,000 members since then. And Holy my fiance, cow. she said, you know, clearly this is a need, not just in our city, but probably everywhere else. Yeah. So I'll be honest, I think I woke up one day and she had created groups all around the country. <laughs> <laughs> so looking out for you. Yeah, so we're cur currently running 17 different groups um, in 17 different cities. You are and, a hustler. Yeah. Wow, so, and that's so important for people that maybe might be local to St. Louis, but they're traveling to Kansas City or Atlanta or Chicago and don't know where to do. And yes. I'm all about maximizing my time, especially when I travel. Yes. So thank you for putting together all that you do. But I wanna talk about this experience booklet. 
give me the download on that. Yes, so Experience Booklet was a company um, that's been running about five years in St. Louis. It was the okay. number one passport in the city with lots of different deals and coupons and this one little uh, black book. I got an example right here. It is like a tiny, adorable little it's, passport, which is literally your passport to St. Louis yes, and other cities. Yes, so we recently purchased this company, um, mainly because, I mean, it is it, it was the top one already, but yeah. blending it with our brand that's already existing, it was like, I had to, you know? It makes so much sense. So in Date Ideas, you are providing all these great things to do, but this is essentially coupons where you can save a lot of dollars. If you know me, now you know me, I love a good coupon. Yes. I'm all about a coupon and being a tourist in St. Louis. So companies can simply sign up. Is it a process of you jump on the website? Yes, so up? if they go to our website, experiencebooklet.com, they would be able to fill out the form there. Um, wow. And it's free. That's, that's the coolest thing. It's free for businesses to be in there. Really? Um, yeah. And they go to the website, they apply, the deadline is coming up. So people need to make a quick choice if they wanna be part of this. I'm thinking, why wouldn't you? But that's just me. Uh, does, is it November 23rd? Yes. That's your deadline? Yes. Great, so people can jump on the website, they can apply at the bottom of the page. It's a super easy process. I mean, I would want to be in that book, but I actually want one of those <laughs> books. I, I will definitely be using stocking one. Stocking yes, stuffers. For sure. So people can have them by the holidays? Yes, so oh, that's stuff. the good thing about what we're doing right now is the pre-order. Mm -hmm. The booklet is valid for the whole year of 2023. But if they purchase okay. now, they'll be able to get it in time to put it under the tree or in a, it's a perfect stocking stuffer. It is. Like, and it looks really cool. It looks really sleek. And so can you give sort of a teaser for some organizations and businesses that are in it or the types of companies we can look yes, for? Yes. Yes. So in this, I, I do want to mention that this is our new cover for 2023. Is that gorgeous or what? Yes. So it's, you know, all different. If you're from St. Louis, you recognize a lot of these different things oh, on it's here. It's so St. Louis. Look at that. Where'd you go to, Where'd high, you go to school? high school? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I know there's toasted ravioli there. Oh my yeah, goodness so gracious. So I'll point out the Ferris wheel. It's, it's kind of hidden in the oh, top corner of course but that is union station and they are in the booklet they have an amazing date night package that they're offering say. there's yep. so much to do there so much um city museum is in there um we got a few surprises i can't mention but oh, they're dang. they're really really good they i believe to, it you'll see it i totally believe <laughs> it so people can't expect things like um, restaurants, boutiques, anything sports related? It's, there are some sports. Yeah, okay. the, that's where those secrets are. I won't ask more, <laughs> but as a sports fan, yeah. I'm excited. <laughs> but it's mainly, um, yes, like we have a couple of hotel things in there, oh, um, wow. restaurants, bars, lots of uh, food and drinks. That's people's favorite. That is all you need in life, I think. I mean, this thing is essential. If you talk about a staycation, you could turn the whole city upside down with that. Morgan, I am delighted that you stopped on a very busy day for you to sit and talk with little old me. Um, oh, thank you awesome. for sharing your ideas. Thank you for your innovation. And thank you for bringing so much exciting awareness to St. Louis. Thank you so much for having me. You are rocking it. You guys definitely follow everything, date ideas and things to do online, as well as find the experience book. Both of those can be found very easily on Facebook, on Instagram as well. And like I said, experiencebooklet.com get there. <laughs> Jump on it on your device right now. If you want to be involved in the 2023, you can submit, you can apply. My fingers will be crossed that you get in. Um, that's going to do it. We are so delighted to have people like Morgan showcasing this amazing city that we call St. Louis. Thanks for keeping it locked in and we will see you next time.